Yowza, yowza, yowza. It is colder than any part of a witch's anatomy you may be familiar with. And it's going to be that way all weekend. That means unless you're one of those skiers or crazy snowboarders, most of us will be tackling indoor sports. (laughs) Isn't it interesting that Valentine's Day comes right after Friday the 13th? I don't know what that means, but it is interesting. Not a big fan of Valentine's Day. It's a holiday whose mascot is a chubby toddler armed with a weapon. I just can't get behind it. Both parties, of course, are supposed to show their love. But really, it's just a day of extortion and reckoning for men. It's the day when all men are judged. And unless you have a fat wallet, you will be found wanting. It's always cards, candy, jewelry. Cards, candy, jewelry. Why is it not uh, power tools, tequila, and an oil change? No, the focus is on women. And ladies, it shows that corporate America believes you can be tamed with a trinket or a bobble. Ladies, you're not that stupid. A 21st century woman is not bought off that easy. They want respect every day. And you can't act like a dumbass all year and then buy your way out of it with some little bit of pampering on one day. It takes a concerted effort on both parts to make a relationship work. A wise man once said to me, you know, one, oh, damn, wipes out a hundred attaboys. Yes, your significant other is not a mind reader, ladies. We're just not built that way. We do not pick up hints. The best thing you can do, a great woman, will go out and buy the gift that she wants, wrap it up, and give it to her man and say, this is going to be the best Valentine's Day ever. Here's my gift. Oh, man, that would allow the male to just take that burden off of his shoulders. You can both go out to have dinner that night, and it'll be smiles all the way around. And smiles are what makes the indoor competition even better. Ladies, you're not going to have to say things like, oh, you must be a banker because you should leave me alone. And guys, you won't have to say something like, "Uh, you know what, honey, not even a sniper would take you out. A wise philosopher, I believe Senor Patron, said, the poor want to be rich, the rich want to be happy, the single want to be married, and the married want want to be dead. So let's make this a weekend of love. What do you say? Big out, pork out, freak out, for this weekend of love is now in session, and you've giata, 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 gotta, 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 zing, 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 with my heartstrings, giata, wig out.